Oh, hi everyone. Is it Mask Monday or is it Vlogmas Day 5? Maybe it's a little bit of both. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back for Vlogmas number five and I'm doing something I haven't done in a long time. I've been masking right along. I've been a masking maniac, but today I decided to do for Vlogmas five a Mask Monday. So welcome all you Mask Monday ladies. I know you guys have been doing this all along, but I, I've, I've got a problem. I've got I've got all these that I haven't opened yet. Can you believe it? And I've been masking all along. But anyway, I usually don't want to open these until I'm ready to put them into my rotation. So I figured today's the day I'm going to do one and get it done. And the mask I'm using today is a K-Beauty face mask. And I thought it was going to, it's polar bear. And I thought maybe it was going to look kind of Christmassy, but it's just a plain white mask. But I just cannot get this to stay straight. But, you know, I love masking. I've been, I other than that month of October, when I got that Style of Anna box, and I wanted to just use their product specifically, so I didn't use any of my sheet mask. But I'm ready to get back into it. I've been doing different other masks. I got a clay mask from Style of Anna that I love using too, but I really love using my sheet mask. They just feel so hydrating. And now that I've kind of had to put the heat on, um, yeah, you can just kind of feel yourself drying out. You go outside to get the mailbox, whoop, you're dry. But anyway, I have got, y'all, well, let's start with the ugly Christmas sweater, shall we? So for Vlogmas, oh, I don't have anything in my hair because I got this. I'll have to look for a kind of Christmassy one. I just kind of got my hair all kind of pushed back any which way I can. And this Christmas sweater, kind of like a plaid. We've got like a sleigh pocket here and a stuffed Santa. We've got a few of these little snowflakes here that are like gold foiled. We've got a little, what is that? I guess it's a, it's a snowman with a little furry hat and just a kind of Christmassy plaid. Kind of like those varsity stripes or something. But anyway, just a nice little Christmas sweater. It's a few years old. It's a little tight in the arms, I'll tell you. But anyway, I've got my face story. And I finally decided this month, I meant to, to put it on hold, but somehow I canceled it. But I have got like six six of them here. One, two, three, four, five, six of them. I'm not even sure what month these are. But anyway, I love getting these. I used to get, um, you know, their, their brand as well. But used to, I think, we used to get like the creme shop and things in there. But then they kind of changed that, I think, probably just to keep uh, the price down. So I get the subscription, 7 Lux. So I get 7 masks. You used to get a free item. And in this month, I got 9 masks. So my free items was 2 additional masks. Alrighty. So I think I'm supposed to go up with this, right? But anyway, we'll show you the mask that I got. So it's 1990. I believe shipping is free on that. And when I got it, I signed up through Crate Joy. So the weekend I did it, it might have been like Black Friday one year. So it was a really nice deal on the first one. But I really enjoyed using them, whether they sent me the creme shop ones or their own ones. Their own ones, their value is usually about $3 each. Some of them are like $2.50 each, but they're usually at least $3. So you always get your money's worth, a few dollars more. And you don't always get a card in here. They kind of go back and forth. They always come well protected. Whatever month this was, had a card. 
maybe it tells me what month it was, but the sheet mask subscription. And it gives me a little explanation of the masks that are in here. And they sent nine masks this month. Oh, first I should go over my coffees. So the coffee that I picked last night was the, um, I believe it was the Green Mountain, the holiday blend. Well, I could not wait because I opened up those cookies from that, cha you, you know, that ch from the Chinese company. I already, already forgot how to say it. It was, you, you know what it is. It'll be in my playlist. But anyway, I got the chocolates. Uh, the cookies that came in that box from that Chinese company that makes those boxes that are really nice. So I, I ended up having the uh, coffee instead of the wine last night, and I had that with a cookie. I was good. I only had one cookie, but it was good. The uh, holiday blend, Green Mountain, it was kind of kind of fruity. It was sweet with like a hazelnut type mixed in there too. So it was different. It's something I wouldn't want to have every day, but for a little flavored coffee here and there, it was good. So I had that. The wine that I picked out today that I'll be sharing in a little bit, but I mentioned it, so I might as well finish it, is uh, Cabernet Sauvignon. And we had one of their Cabernet Sauvignons with the Merlot blend, and that was really, really good. The coffee that we picked to have tomorrow morning is from the Donut Shop. And just their regular blend. And this is a good coffee too. I know we used to always get this at work to use in the Keurig up front. So this is always, that always went fast. A lot of guests that came in. And from the, my advent calendar from Lint. We got another one of those tiny little truffles. That is so good. So I will have that a little bit later. All right, so let's just go over these masks. And I'm probably not going to tell you because the printing camera is really small. So I'll just kind of hold them up and show you each one that we got this week or whatever month this was. I wonder if this brochure tells me what month it was. But we got this. Whoa, that's H2O. So this one says it's got jasmine flower extract and it contains moisturizing properties that protect the skin with its antibacterial properties. So that sounds like a good one. Next one we got is Let's Talk Vitality. And this says it's pomegranate fruit extract, which is antioxidant rich ingredient that helps slow down the signs of aging, creating smooth and supple skin. So that sounds like one I need. This one is Ace That Face Collagen Sheet Mask. So it's got um, hydrolyzed collagen. It's a moisturizing ingredient that pumps your skin and helps reduce the appearance of fine legs. Fine, not fine legs. I don't have legs on my face. Fine lines and wrinkles. Not yet, anyway. Alrighty, so this next one is, oh my goodness. So this is a snail mask. So I'm going to love using this one. So this is snail secretion filtrate. It contain, contains nutrients such as hyaluronic acid and I don't know, glycoprotein to help the skin and prevent signs of aging. So that should be a good one. I got my mask going in my mouth as I'm trying to talk and that's kind of makes it awkward. Awkward. Alrighty, so this next one is De Let's Talk Detox. It's a pore refining mask that has charcoal and volcanic ash. So that should be good to help clean out the pores. This next one is called an Everyday AC Rejuvenating Mask. So it's got the AC extract. It says this ingredient is a is packed with antioxidants. It uh, protects your skin from environmental pollutants while ensuring your skin is hydrated and moisturizing. Alrighty, so that was six. The next one is an everyday charcoal mask. So another charcoal max, no harsh chemicals. So it says it's got charcoal extract, the ingredient that helps clarify the skin by removing impurities and controlling oil production. 
Ooh, this one, I've had this one before. I love this one. So this is Dream God Camille or Chamomile Waffle Mask. So it's got the, I can't say that word right, not just because the mask is going in my mouth. Chamomile uh, flower water. The flower is rich in antioxidants and anti-inflammatory ingredients, which help calm angry, inflamed skin. Sometimes my skin does get quite angry. Alrighty, and this last one is I Pinky Promise. So this one says it's got, ooh, beetroot extract. I thought it said root beer and I was getting thirsty. Beetroot extract, high in vitamin C. This ingredient provides the skin with protecting and strengthening properties to prevent fine lines, dullness, and drainage? Damage. Yeah. I think when I did this, I touched my glasses and, and now my glasses are filthy. I can't see. I know. Excuses. Excuses. So the wine, I'm using my glass from Snap Elf with the ugly Christmas sweater. So cute. I am going to love getting different glasses from her. It's really affordable too. And I got my handy dandy opener. So I hope everyone is having a fantastic mask Monday. I'm glad that I opened up these to get them into my rotation because I've been using some of the newer ones that I've, I've gotten like Ipsy and things like that in the add-ons. So I kind of like to use some of the older ones first. As you can see, the older ones kind of dry up. This is probably pretty much dry. So we're just going to pour it in my glass. Might as well put the cap on. And I haven't been doing this because I just kind of feel awkward um, without makeup on and things like that. I just kind of feel like my scars show a lot more and, you know, just the droopiness from the stroke and the muscle loss on the cancer side. So kind of makes me feel odd. But anyway, it's for Vlogmas, so... I hope you guys forgive me. So anyway, cheers, everyone. Have a happy Mask Monday. Take care, everyone. Be safe. Be kind. Have fun. Be happy. Enjoy life. And I love you guys so much. And we will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 6. Love you guys. Bye-bye.